Hey, it's Sherry LaDuce here, your independent Norwix consultant. I just wanted to share with you five tips to having an amazing party. But before we get started, I want to tell you that the best way for you to get Norwex in your house for free is for you to become a consultant yourself. Now, if you're thinking, no, there's no way I can do what you do. Yeah, you can. I used to be a preschool teacher before this. So if I can do it, you can do it. And also, you don't need to do what I do. You can become a consultant and just have it for your family. You don't have to do parties. Isn't that awesome? So if you're interested, send me a message about it. I'd love to talk to you about it. Okay, so for my tips, tip number one is to invite and excite. So people are going to want to come to your party if you tell them why you love Norwex, if you share it with them, if you make it personable to them, if you just really share what you love about it. You can tell them your stories, your experience about it. I know when I first started... I shared with a few of my family members that after dinner time, I just dreaded cleaning the high chair because it just felt like I was rubbing the food in. <laughs> and it would take me sometimes half an hour to clean the high chair. But with Norwex, when I first used it, it was like three wipes and it was done. And I was like, yes. Um, so tell people that your stories and your experience with them. With the products and I will be sending you a hostess packet with some samples in it so feel free to use those and to tell people post pictures about it um, people are gonna be interested if you share what makes it so amazing enough for you to have a party with me okay so my second thing is to post comments to share your experiences and to respond to your friends I mean they are here for you now, if you're comfortable making a video and posting it on, on our Facebook party, go for it. Um, but if you're not, don't feel like you have to. All I ask is that you, um, you respond to your friends. And again, I know that everyone is busy. It is such a busy time this year of year. And I think that people have just gotten busier and busier. And so my parties are super laid back. I don't expect for you or for me to be sitting at the computer all day and so that's why I just do posts throughout the day and if you can catch up all at the end of the day or all in the morning do it um, and feel free to tell your guests that you know um, when you're inviting them just say it's gonna be super laid back um, just check it out you know when you have time you know check out the posts everything will be numbered so you won't miss anything um, my tip number three is for you to tag people in things. Now, people sometimes don't like to tag people people in comments because you feel like you're bugging them. But really, it's just like, hey, check this out. Okay? So if you think, for example, my aunt really hates cleaning the toilet. So if, um, so for one of my parties, you know, she was joining and I said, hey, Jamie, check this out. Um, that way it's just kind of like reminding them or maybe, you know, they're busy, right? They don't see it. So, um, just tag them and then just say, check this out when you have time. Again, they're here to party with you. You know them, um, when you talk to them about doing the party, um, you could say, is there a room you really hate to clean? Because I really hate to clean the bathroom. What about you? So tip number four is there has to be a booking from this party because that's the way you're going to get the most rewards from this party. So when you're inviting your friends, if they're like, you know what, this sounds amazing, but I just don't think I can afford it right now. You can tell them you don't need to pay anything right now. Just check it out and see if you like it. And, um, and if they like it, they can host a party with me. They might win a prize for being part of the party. Woohoo! And you don't need to pay anything to win a prize or to host a party. Um, another thing to keep in mind, if someone has a really big wish list, you can encourage them like, hey, you could buy a little bit now and then maybe you should book a party with Sherry because then you could get the rest for free, you know? Ah. So 
Um, tip number five is that we are going to be a gracious host. So when someone purchases something, I will be putting a graphic and I'll say thank you. And it'd be really nice if you said thank you too, especially if they're your guests, you know, telling them thanks for coming. I hope you like it. Um, whatever you want to say. So those are my tips for having an amazing party. If you have any questions throughout, um, our party from now until whenever feel free to reach out to me and when you're done watching this video message me and say strawberry because that is the keyword to moving on